Hi guys, so this is my bill exchange and condensing video. If you haven't joined Fetch Rewards, I am so close to reaching my 50,000 goal. Please join so you can too. Also, beware if you're buying gift cards right now because you don't want to pay extra for them. Some are charging additional prices just to purchase the card. You don't have to do that. And I'm so close to 2,000 subscribers, so hopefully we will get there. I also took advantage of my rewards I have with Starbucks. I went there and enjoyed me a wonderful treat on them. Well, it's on me because I'm the one that built up the points, but you know what I'm saying. Anyway, let's get to condensing. So I ended up condensing a little over $500 and I was happy because I didn't realize that um, my little envelopes and challenges had saved up that much, those many um, bills, but it felt good to um, be able to condense because you know, I've been trying to condense for a minute and I just hadn't got there. But um, two months in, well, let's see, I started in September so three months in, I think that's pretty good to be able to condense 500 and something dollars. And later I will um, be able to finally use my little green bills. You'll see that later. But um, it felt good to condense these funds. I, I like counting money. I really do, uh, especially when it's mine <laughs> and not anybody else's. But yeah, I, was, I see how you ladies feel now when you're um, condensing your funds and you're saying, oh, my binders are so fat. Oh, I need to condense the money. Uh, I can't wait to get to that point either. But um, this little bit that I have, it didn't uh, make my binder stick out fat, but it felt good anyway to be able to just count something, count something up a little bit and um, go to the bank and just be able to put it in the bank. I want to share something about that. I did think I was going to just leave the cash into my savings challenges containers, but thanks to a wonderful budgeter um, who's also on YouTube, uh, she shared that I shouldn't just leave the money in there, even though I like counting real money. She should uh, sorry, I can't talk. She suggested that I take it to the bank. Um, she actually su suggested that I open an Alley account, but I decided to um, do something else with it, which you'll see in just a few moments. But thank you for joining me. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And also comment if you have some suggestions or if you have some other type of feedback. I welcome all types of feedback. Thank you. So... Now that I have condensed the funds and exchanged the billing, I want to go to the bank. And remember, I had introduced my little green dollars in one of my very, very first videos, hoping I could use them one day. And I'm happy to say, thanks to my savings challenges, that I'm able to probably take some money to the bank. So I have my little money envelope that will travel with me to and from the bank. Um, this is my bank bag. Um, it's got the little polka dots on it with the money on it. So this is my bank bag. And um, I'm going to see how much I can, can put the stock money in. I have only two fifties. I just ordered some from an Etsy shop. So hopefully they'll arrive soon. But until they do, I'm going to use the ones that I've created myself. And these are just the hundred dollar bills. Um, I couldn't do the real, real money. I'm going to get some and see how it goes. But that, that looks too close to real money. I don't know. I'll have to see about that. So we're going to try to enjoy my blue tea y'all see my blue pea flower tea i love it i love it i'm going to enjoy that and i'm going to try to exchange so let's start with the um g babies because as y'all know that built up really really fast and I, I i was able to exchange some dollars for it we have one and 50, we'll keep the six. So I'll do one and I'm gonna do the 
G, the 50, the glamorous 50, like my G and my G baby. And then I'll replace the 50 and the one over here that goes to the bank. So now G baby has one, 50, five, and six. And I was going to start me an Alley account, um, but I already have three savings accounts and they're pretty good. That's all that we're gonna do in this one. They're pretty good. So I'm gonna try those first. If by chance um, they don't acquire enough or they don't work out for me, then I may try to do an Alley account. I just don't feel like I need to start another account. I don't want all these accounts anywhere. So I like the Alley idea, but I already got two um, federal credit unions and I have one Capital One savings that actually has pretty good interest as well. So I'm going to try those, um, one of those three. I may do split between all, depending on how much I come up with, because I'm acting like I have a lot of money here to do something with, but I really don't. So I know we're going to keep the ones. I can put that back in there. Got a 20 and we got a hundred and we got 50. So I'm going to take all the fifties. I'm going to take my last 50 and my, one of my hundreds and I'm going to put it in the Tic Tac Doe challenge. So that leaves 150, 70, 172, 73, 74 in Tic Tac Doe. Y'all, I am so happy to be able to use my little green placers because whew, I, I just, um, it's been a journey. I was looking at some videos of some ladies who did, who's been on this journey for a while. And matter of fact, thanks to one of them, they were the ones that encouraged me to actually take the money out and, um, exchange it and put it in the bank don't let it just sit in the jar it looks cute i love counting real money i really do but it earns you money while sitting in your savings account instead of in the bucket here so we'll put the 21 back and i got 100 and 200 and we'll get one and two placeholders and we'll take that to the bank and that but I'm so happy to be able to use, um, let's see, now the um, gift cards has 100, 200, 21. Woo, it's on up there, you guys. I can't wait to get the gift cards. Yeah, so they encouraged me to do that. And it's, that's really the safest way to do it. You don't want to have all this money laying around. Um, somewhere. So that's the safest way to do it. So thank them. Shouts out to those that helped me because you know I need help. You know I need help. Thank you. So in um, Hangman, we have 51, 155, and 6. So I don't have any more 50s. So I'm going to just do the 50s. The, that makes 100. Replace it with 1. So now we have in Hangman, 150. 556. All right, let's go over here and the word scramble challenge. We're going to keep the 20s and 5s and 1s, put those back in there. And we have 100, 250. We're going to keep the 50 because I don't have any more 50s. But we're going to exchange the 200s with place money. So in it, it has, uh, let's see, 100, 250, 75, 76, and 77, 277. That word scrapple wasn't no joke. Okay, in this one, we just have 55, 56, 57. So because I don't have any 50s, I'm gonna get some soon. I'll just leave this in here for now. And in our color coding, we have 20, 40, 5, or 6, 47. So we don't even have enough to change out 450. So I'm just going to leave this in here for now as well. All right. So remember my IOUs I had, my two IOUs. Well, I did pay myself back. I do have a contract with myself to pay my business back for loaning me this money. And... 
I'm so happy that I was able to do that. So let's see how much we have. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, and 5. So 75 and 50, 125. And I will trade these 20s for a 100. So that still leaves the 125. Only 100 will be in the bank earning what little interest it can earn. So let's see how much we got, guys, that we are taking to the bank. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 2, 3, 4, 5, $900 is going to the bank. Remember when on one of my earlier videos, I was only able to take $100 to the bank. I'm taking $900 to the bank. Yay, $900 to the bank. So thank you guys for helping me and telling me that it's best to just put it in the bank, put it in the bank and um, take a sip of my blue pea flower tea. So I will be doing that today. And again, it's $900. And I think I am going to just simply put it all in one account for now instead of trying to disperse it. And when I finish this whole challenge, then maybe I'll do something with it. But isn't that great? Are you guys proud of me? I'm proud of myself. I'm patting myself on the back. I'm patting myself on the back. So see you guys next time. And I hope that your money bags fill up at just as soon as mine did. And we're still on a journey of learning. So please continue to share all of your wonderful ideas with me. I welcome them. I appreciate it. And yes, yes, yes. I'm going to get some sticky notes because y'all know I forget my couch. So I got some sticky notes on the way. Thank you. Bye-bye.